Over six million Americans suffer from angina. But what exactly is angina? Angina is chest pain or discomfort that occurs when the heart muscle is not getting enough oxygen. Angina is not the same thing as a heart attack, although its symptoms can sometimes appear similar. Angina occurs when the coronary arteries, the primary source of blood for the heart, become partially blocked by a buildup of fatty deposits called plaque. This buildup reduces the flow of blood to the heart, decreasing the supply of oxygen and causing the pain we experience as angina. There are three different types of angina. Stable angina is the most common type. With stable angina, pain occurs only when the heart is exerting itself more than normal and usually subsides when at rest. Unstable angina is a serious condition that requires emergency treatment and sometimes signals an impending heart attack. Unstable angina is different from stable angina in that it can occur more frequently, can feel more severe, it can occur or continue while at rest. Prinz Metal's angina is an unusual kind of angina that occurs when the patient is at rest, is exposed to cold temperatures, or is sleeping. Diagnosing angina requires a physical exam, a comprehensive medical history, and possibly a series of diagnostic tests. It is a complex condition that can only be diagnosed by your doctor. While it may be possible for a physician to determine if you have angina just from the physical exam and history, tests will often need to be ordered to confirm the diagnosis. These tests may include an EKG, which measures the regularity of your heartbeat, stress tests to see how your heart responds to exercise, and diagnostic blood tests. For patients suffering from angina, there are several effective treatment options available. The first and simplest option is lifestyle change. Your doctor can advise you on how to make dietary changes, lose weight, and change your physical activities to avoid angina episodes. Your doctor may also be able to prescribe medications that can help with your angina. For example, nitrates can be used to both relieve pain during the onset of an episode and to actually prevent an episode. When other methods do not work, angioplasty or surgery may be necessary to treat angina. It is important to understand that not all chest pain or discomfort is angina. Chest pain can be caused by any number of factors, including heart attack, lung problems, heartburn, or a panic attack. If you are experiencing chest pain, whether you believe it is angina or something different, please see a physician as soon as possible.